one of the primary goals of Zoho was to develop SaaS solutions addressing the various departments and be a one-stop shop for the needs of uh, both SMBs as well as the enterprise. The biggest value that technology or software can actually bring to a company is to allow the company to make better decisions. That is really the role of business analytics today. So when you have a large volume of data coming from the various departments, it's true that there would be uh, reporting solutions on a per department basis. There is another aspect of the data when you mingle the data from across the departments and provide a lot more intelligence, especially at a CXO layer. Uh, towards this, uh, uh, one of the main goals was to develop a Zoho uh, reporting. Originally, it started as a Zoho reporting solution and then it evolved into BI and analytics solution. First version of Zoho Analytics uh, was released in the market in 2009. The early version of the product was called Zoho Reports. At that point of time, there were solutions available out there for reporting and uh, BI, but most of them were on-premise and they were very developer focused. The, one of the main goals of Zoho Reports and BI solution was to be uh, available in the cloud and address the needs of business users. The goal of what we want to really do in this marketplace was to offer a self-service BA analytics platform. Our focus had been towards offering a solution for the business users that enables them to analyze any data, create nice visualizations, get to insights faster, and not only focus on historical insights, but also look at offering capabilities that will enable them to look at the future. With Zoho reports, which can integrate data not only from other Zoho solutions, but also from other third-party SaaS or on-prem products. It's bringing together that information, the knowledge of the systems, the connections between systems, insights, so companies can actually make better decisions. Do we have a compelling vision? Enterprise players need a compelling vision because enterprises don't like switching systems. They need to know what they signed up for is going to be the direction the product is headed the next five, ten years. This overall vision of what we want to build was predicated upon three important pillars. The first being data management, the second visualization analytics, and third is insights and action. All across each one of these pillars, we really want to embed the latest technologies in such a way that the complexity of the technology is taken away, but the benefits of these technologies are given to the business users in a much more easy and consumable fashion. In Zoho Analytics Solution, we have our own AIML stack, uh, wherein we take the data that is available uh, within the product, within the service, and then we apply lots of algorithms on top of it, pick what is the best algorithm to apply and provide the answer to the end user. If you look at the entire workflow of a BA, BA system, right? It starts from data integration, data management, visualization analytics and insights. And this is what we really wanted to cover as part of what we built, right? And that is the reason why we call what we are building as a unified data management and analytics platform. This new name that we launched in 2018 really fitted the bill in terms of what we want to offer as a product line and how we really wanted to position this product in this marketplace. Being a practitioner and I've seen the product evolve from being a cloud-based reporting and analytics application to all the way to doing the things that it does today from embedded BI to unified business analytics to the augmented analytics capabilities it's been a fabulous journey that I've been a part of. Zoho uh, Analytics Solution has been in the forefront and there's a lot of R&D that goes into it, not only in terms of user interface, there's also a lot of uh, R&D that goes in ensuring that the data backend, which powers the solution, is world-class and it's able to provide the respective reports in double quick time. When we were invited to participate in the Magic Quadrant, and it's not easy. The selection process is extremely intense and they identify the top 10, top 12 players that make that market impact. And to be told initially that we didn't make enough market impact to then be invited, it was a huge milestone for the team and I. Feedback from the analytics and enterprise application analysts have been phenomenal. 
This is one of the most exciting products in their mind and one of the difference makers for Zoho, according to their research. I can already see the progression as now analysts are asking us about Zoho Analytics instead of the other way around. Zoho's DNA has always been of committed engineering investment on any domain that we take up. Not only that, we always stay on the game for the long run, what we call as perseverance. With these two attributes together, we are sure in the time to come, we can really establish Zoho Analytics as the leader in this particular market.